just been diagnosed with an incurable disease. I am worn out, scared, and depressed. I don't know where to turn to, but I know you're with me always. Fight my battles, dear Lord rescue me from this pit and help me to walk in the divine health that Jesus died on the cross for me to have. Uproot fear from my heart and help me to walk in boldness, knowing that the doctor's report is not the final report comes. Dear God, the doctors have said that I only have a few months to live. I have been told to get everything in order. But that is not what you promised me in the word. You have promised to satisfy me with long life. Therefore, I refuse the words that the doctors have spoken over me, and I cancel and nullify that evil report in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and declare that I am prospering in my health even as my soul prospers. O oh Lord, I feel so broken because of this sickness. My spirit is crushed because I do not know whether I will make it or not. Give me a cheerful heart because it is good medicine for my body. Fill me with joy in my heart even as I go through this challenging time. And when the pain is too much, remind me of your love and your presence that I may be able to fight the good fight of faith. May healing manifest in my body, soul, and spirit that I may serve you for the rest of my life. Gracious Father, be merciful unto me for I have sinned against you. I've opened demonic doors of sickness and disease in my body because of sin. Forgive me, O Lord, and take away this pain. Fill me with divine strength that I may be healthy again. Help me to have a teachable spirit that I may walk in your precepts. Dear Lord, your word says that your blessings will be on our food and water, and you will take sickness from among us when we worship you. Remove disease from my body and make me whole again. Help me to walk in good health that I may be productive in everything I do and worship you with all my heart and soul. If there's anything wrong, I have done that has opened the door for the enemy to inflict sickness on my body. Father, I ask you to forgive me and grant me good health. Thank you for answering my prayers. Heavenly Father, the doctor's report is out, and the results are very devastating. Please grant me the courage to accept that my days on earth are numbered. As I face each day and draw near to the day that I will leave this world, help me to remember that life is but a mist. Remind me of your love that I may hold on to your word. Where there is fear, replace it with courage and the desire to come and be home with you, Lord. Help me to see dying as another way of healing from the pain and sorrows of this world. God in heaven, I put my trust in you, for I know that you will never fail me. Lord, my beloved one has been diagnosed with an incurable disease, and the doctors have said that we only have a few days with him. But Lord, times and seasons are in your hand. You're the only one who knows what is going to happen a few days from today. Lord, if it is his time to come home and be with you, help us to spend the time that we have with him in peace and love. If it's not your will for him to die, then Daddy stretches your healing hand, touch him, and let him receive his healing. O oh Lord, thank you for the many years that you wanted me to live on this earth. I have fought a good fight. And now it's time for me to come back home and be with you. Lord, I am happy because I'm coming to be in your presence where there is fullness of joy. Grant my family the strength to move on after I depart this earth. 
Remind them of your love and help them to know that to be away from my body means that I'm with you. May I walk in your ways up to the last minute on this earth. Lord Jesus, my body hurts, I cannot sit or sleep in peace. All I feel is pain. The medicine that the doctors have given me is not working anymore. Please help me. Wrap me in your hands and take away this pain from my body. Strengthen me and hold me with your right hand. Heavenly Father, as my life on earth comes to an end, I ask you to draw near to me. Walk with me and give me the courage to face death. Thank you for your loving kindness and mercies over my life. Usher me in your throne of grace with love. God in heaven, fill the hearts of those that are sick, dying, and elderly with hope. Remind them that nothing is too difficult for you because all power and might are in your hands. Father, restore them and make them healthy again that they may be able to serve you and glorify your name. Lord, may they soar on wings like eagles that they may run and not grow weary, they may walk and not faint. Heavenly Father, thank you for you are a just and righteous God. Even though you are a holy God, you love us with all our flaws. There is none like you, my King. Healing and wholeness lie in your hands. You heal those that cry out to you day and night for help. That is why I come before your throne to ask you to heal me and make me whole again. Remove this sickness from my body and cause me to enjoy good health for the glory of your name. O Lord, comfort the sick, those that are dying and the elderly. Cover them with your wings and strengthen their hearts that they may continue worshiping you. Help them to find comfort in your word because, in it, there is healing and wholeness. King of glory, you were wounded for our transgressions and crushed for our iniquities. The punishment that brought us peace was upon you, and by your stripes we are healed. Please, Lord, may healing manifest in the bodies of those that are sick. May they recover speedily so that they can enjoy your goodness in the land of the living. Dear Lord Jesus, Thank you for the sacrifice you made at the scourging post. It was not easy, but because of your great love for us, you took all that sickness and disease in your body that we could enjoy divine health. Lord Jesus, please restore my body to health and cause me to enjoy divine health for the rest of my life. O oh God of heaven and earth, Thank you for your love towards us in that while we were still sinners, Christ died for us. It is because of that great sacrifice that I come before your throne of grace to ask you to grant me good health. I decree and declare that death has no dominion over me. Sickness leave my body right now. I will not die young but live to declare the glorious works of the Lord. O oh God, I am fearful about what is happening to my health. Instead of getting better, I am becoming worse and spending so much money going from doctor to doctor to find a cure. But Lord, your word says there is no fear in love, but perfect love casts out fear. Let your loving kindness fill my heart that I may overcome fear and fight this disease. Father, thank you for the life of our beloved Son. Thank you for the time she gave us to spend together with him. Thank you for making him part of our family. Lord, right now, he's on life support, and the doctor says there's nothing they can do from this point on. We need to let him go. As we come to terms with what is about to happen, Help us to be grateful for his life. 
We are letting him go knowing that he's coming to you where he will experience true healing from all the pain that he has been in while here on earth. Father God, some people have given up hope because doctors have told them that they have life-threatening diseases. Father, as they come to terms with everything that is happening to them, help them to be strong in you. Guard their minds against the lies of the enemy that they may focus on your glory that awaits them in heaven. Heavenly Father, I pray for all those that have been given a few days to live. Grant them peace in the inner being that they may prepare to come into your presence with joy and thanksgiving. I also pray for those that do not know you. May they come to know you before their time to depart reaches. Lord, let your presence manifest wherever they are that they may know you're with them till the end of the time. Dear Father, I pray for the older people who are finding it hard to allow other people to take care of them because they're used to taking care of themselves. Help them to know that your grace is sufficient for them during this time as other people take charge of their lives. May they see their caretakers as a blessing in their lives and not a curse. Lord, I speak a word of blessings over everyone that has committed themselves to take care of the elderly. Give them patience and understanding that they may be able to take care of the elderly well. May they speak words of healing to the elderly that will help them to walk in good health. O oh Lord, please grant the elderly that are struggling with condemnation peace. Remove anxiety from the heart and help them to know that they have been forgiven of their past, present, and future sins. May they come to understand your love so that they can live in peace, good health, and enjoy their old age. Expose the lies that the enemy has been feeding their mind and help them to come out as victors. O oh Lord, as we become old and frail, it becomes hard for us to do things the way we used to do them in our youthful years. Our bodies become subject to sickness and disease, and this makes life hard. But Lord, you promise in your word that you will take care of us even when we are old. Heal every older person that is dealing with sickness and disease right now. Remove pain from their bodies and help them to enjoy their old age. Heavenly Father, be a source of refuge for the elderly who are struggling with life-threatening diseases in their bodies. Satan is attacking them with sickness and disease and causing them to live in distress. Let them see you as their source of refuge, and may your healing power rest upon their bodies. In Jesus' name, I pray, amen.